Baye TV, a wane baba, iruye, a sha, a tipi to jetin besi, o do wa le o ti do, a Baye TV, file, file. Good morning, my people. This is Agbaye TV. This is Agbaye Television, where we bring you back-to-back -back updates on what is happening around the globe. The video I'm about to show you um, is the video Dino Melaye did um, to give his own side of the story after exchanging hot words um, with, the, uh, with the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, um, that is Peter Obi, like people will call him obedient. Uh, you know, he gave his own side of the story, and um, I would like you to watch and listen to what Dino Milai have to say after the show. Now, quickly before I show you the video, if you are just joining this um, this channel, very, very first time, or maybe you are just coming across this channel, I buy television, please do subscribe on this channel and don't forget to press the notification button it will give you access to all our videos that we are dropping and all content we are dropping on this video please do well to subscribe please stay tuned and enjoy the video and i will be right back thank you fellow country men and women i am doing this video just to clarify the outburst by peter obi the presidential candidate of labor party yesterday he was not provoked I was sitting far opposite the top um, seat where they were sitting. I didn't mention his name, and I was really surprised to see that type of outburst from a presidential candidate. Is that the type of president he's going to make? Just taking on people and uh, showing on presidential characteristics. The way he acted yesterday was very, very, he rather called me out because there was no way um, I didn't do anything. I didn't call his name. I didn't, I mean, where I was sitting, there's nothing I would have said that Obi would have heard. And there was nothing. I didn't do anything. So that outburst is unwarranted, very unpresidential, unacceptable of a leader. A leader must be matured. One who wants to govern this country must be accommodating must have a lot of patience, must have perseverance. These are basic characteristics of leadership anywhere in the world. You want to be president of Nigeria and you are reacting in such a manner in public, uh, this one will slap ADC for office as president. So I want to clear the air that there was nothing, I didn't do anything to him. He was so provoked and so carried away by the performance of Oko, the governor Okowa, that he was saying that somebody outside is from ANPP. Does that make any sense? Is there any party like ANPP in Nigeria today? ANPP collapsed in 2014 when they all amalgamated and met together to form a, 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 a APC. But he was so disorganized, so disoriented that he was saying that the person out there is uh, from ANPP. Is there any party like ANPP in Nigeria today? Next time when you want to go for a debate, be as calm as Governor Okowa. Be as calm as uh, the PDP vice presidential candidate. But that was very unpresidential, and I deserve, I mean, a serious apology. Thank you very much. All right, thank you for watching the video. Once again, this is Agbaye Television. Hope you enjoy the content. Please, we promise you, we always drop the content that will be helpful. All that is happening all around the globe is what we'll be bringing to this channel. Please, don't forget to subscribe. Please, please, please subscribe. And please, do well to press the notification button to receive all content we'll be dropping on this channel. Thank you. God bless you. Have a wonderful day.